Good afternoon and welcome back to Farming with Faith channel, Shaney Farms, Shaney Farms Estivation. Yes, you hear my bobcat in behind me. Uh, today I recruited help. Uh, today we have the job of, this is what, day four of softball field demolition and property cleanup. So today um, we had the job of sawing down and removing the electric poles, eight electric poles and the storeboard and poles from around the field. And as you can see, there's not a electric pole in sight. Uh, they're right here. They're, they are right here on the burn pile. Um, a couple of them was so rotted that I actually pushed them over with a bobcat. Um, and let's see, we, uh, what I would do, they all had to fall toward the center of the field. So a buddy of mine would notch them toward the center of the field. And I, did, I would get on the opposite side of the notch and I would put pressure on it and he'd saw it. And I would push, and it pushed right over into the middle of the field, right where we wanted to. I love it when a plant comes together, just like Hannibal Smith of the A-Team. Anyway, um, so with that being said, eight electric poles have hit the ground and have been pushed to the pile in the burn pile. And we was actually able to dig out and pull some of the bottoms of the poles which might be even better and if y'all were wondering what happened to the bed steel poles and the storeboard the original tota tola storeboard there it is ladies and gentlemen tamed down in one piece what i done i pushed a little bit on one side of, on one pole Eased it over, pushed a little bit on the other side, eased it over. It hit the ground fairly soft. And me and a buddy of mine, we loaded the poles. And as you can see, it's solid poles. And as you can see, I have a Tota storeboard in fairly good condition. So if anybody is interested in a uh, uh, original Tota Tola baseball softball field storeboard uh message me anyway as you can see i mean it still has original hooks and i mean it's in fairly good shape and uh yeah so anyway so buddy of mine we're still trying we're trying to dig out the last post bottom of the electric pole for the day and I think he's doing a dead to China. <laughs> no pun intended. I think he's doing dead a hole all the way to China here in a little bit. Anyway, uh, the, the owner wants the uh, poles neither uh, sawed, out, sawed off underneath the ground or pulled out or whatever. So we was actually able to pull some of them out couple of them we wouldn't but while my saw man is here hence the one down the bobcat um we are trying to dig that one out so um stay tuned for more the dumpsters are supposed to be here in the morning at least one of them so i will be back on the job in the morning loading dumpsters so yeah he's I had it moving. I had it shaking. I just couldn't pull, pull. I just couldn't budget. I couldn't pull it out. So he's a wild man. Oh, he's a wild man. I think he's doing did it to China, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, 
He's in there, don't pull it out or break it. Oh. I told you he may did the China before it's all said and done. Oh, he's out of moving. Oh. The last electric pole stump of the day of the whole entire field. <laughs> Before this video is too long, I, uh, yeah, y'all have a blessed day, stay safe, and like I said, um, I have an original tow to tell the storyboard in fairly good shape. It's going home with me. So, y'all have a blessed day, stay safe, and y'all have a blessed Sunday. Bye.